we are now going to see how n choose r is equal to n minus 1 choose r plus n minus 1 choose r minus 1 okay so this just follows from our definition of n choose r and what is that n choose r is given by factorial n divided by factorial r times n minus r factorial now that becomes your left hand side right perfect now what is the right hand side n minus 1 choose r which becomes n minus 1 factorial divided by r factorial times n minus 1 minus r factorial plus and this n minus 1 choose r minus 1 becomes n minus 1 factorial divided by r minus 1 factorial into n minus 1 minus r plus 1 factorial why is that i just subtract n minus 1 and r minus 1 rather r minus 1 is subtracted from n minus 1 that's why you get n minus 1 minus r minus of 1 and minus minus becomes plus so you have a minus 1 and a plus 1 here which gets cancelled which gives you simply n minus r factorial here so this is the same old old school method of trying to prove a formula by showing that the left hand side is indeed equal to right hand side let's see how we can proceed as you can see there is a n factorial in the numerator on the left hand side and n minus 1 factorial on the right hand side so i'll take n minus 1 factorial common on the right hand side and then bring that down to left hand side which makes it n factorial divided by n minus 1 factorial which you all know what is 10 factorial by 9 factorial it is simply 10 right so n factorial divided by n minus 1 factorial happens to be n correct so you get an n here and these things numerators become 1 and 1 on the right hand side okay and then next do you observe r factorial in the denominator throughout and an r minus 1 factorial here so what i do is i will multiply the numerators by r factorial so what do i get r factorial gets cancelled here when i put r factorial in the numerator on the left hand side and then r factorial again on the right hand side gets cancelled but when you put a r factorial here in the second term r factorial divided by r minus 1 factorial gives you r so r remains in the numerator right and then the next step do you see what's happening i'm multiplying throughout by n minus r factorial right and that gives me simply a little observation one more step tells me this simply makes this n equals n minus r the first term becomes n minus r right rest gets cancelled plus r so n equals n minus r plus r plus r minus r gets cancelled this implies n equals n of course left hand side is equal to right hand side and so you go back and you say that the formula is indeed right so how do we show that n choose r is equal to n choose n minus r right in, in a very mathematical way so what is n choose r factorial n divided by factorial r into factorial n minus r correct but what is n choose n minus r it is n factorial divided by n minus r factorial times n minus of n minus r factorial you see n and minus n gets cancelled and this becomes r here and as you can see the left hand side is equal to right hand side remember this is how we used to show a lot of uh, things to be true in our school days basic algebra right so lhs is equal to rhs and hence we show that n choose r is indeed equal to n choose n minus r 